Hi Sheiksters, hi YouTube. So today's video is gonna be a new in haul. I have not filmed a haul for you guys since December. I have a small cross section of the new in pieces that I've picked up to share with you guys. So I've got some Valentine's Day stuff in here. If you're looking for like some date night inspo, I've also got um, just like some good basics as well as a few, you know, fashion finds in here. I'm so excited to get into this video because I got, I found some really great deals last month. My favorite find was definitely a two piece set that I picked up for under $15. Yes, you heard me, under $15. And I think right now you can actually get it for $11. But before I spill the tea, um, and before I get into this video, comment down below, let me know what your favorite fashion find has been this season. This item is gonna be this gorgeous top that you guys already seen me wear in my Easy Styling Tips video. And I already got somebody asking me about the top. It's super cute. It's like a brand that I recently discovered. Like I didn't even know this brand existed. And I don't know if it's a new brand or if it just was like really well hidden, but it is, I picked it up from New York and Company and it is from the Happy Nature brand. So this brand is actually um, created by Kate Hudson. I believe it's Kate Hudson's brand. If I'm wrong, I will correct myself in the description below. But if you love like, 70s vintage hippie vibes. This is a must have brand to check out. They have such good pieces. Now it's a little bit on the higher side of when it comes to the price point. Um, I happened to pick this up on sale. So that's why I grabbed it and I'm gonna be stocking that brand for their sales because they do have some really great sales on there. But the average price of things on that on this side of New York and Company is about like 50 bucks, but it's totally worth it. I can see why the quality is great. It's also a sustainable brand. You know, we're all about trying to be as sustainable as possible. I'm not a sustainability warrior. If you are, please kick out of this video because I'm not about to get into that argument with anybody. So that explains why the price point is a little bit higher, um, but it's just a gorgeous top. It's just giving me totally, 70s vibes actually comes with a matching like belt thing or a scarf thing that you can loop around your neck if you really want to go for that full 70s vibe and i styled it with my new glasses that i have been absolutely loving 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 from amazon <clears throat> so i picked up a bunch of colorful turtlenecks from amazon so last month Listen, I did a lot of damage on Amazon. I'm about to put myself on an Amazon no buy from decor stuff to clothing stuff. I spent way too much money. But one of the things that I picked up was are, are these turtlenecks. I'm actually wearing the purple one now. I freaking love these turtlenecks. I believe I got them in the largest size which is a 2XL, but I will put all that information for you in the description box. I picked up this one in pink, I picked up one in purple, and I picked up one in orange, because as some of you might be aware, I did the 14 day style challenge on Instagram, where I basically shared an outfit a day for two weeks, um, two weeks-ish. <laughs> Anyways, um, and one thing I realized from doing that style challenge was how neutral my wardrobe was but how much you guys loved when I shared like looks with pops of color. So I figured I would, you know, expand a little bit, come out a little bit of my comfort zone. And one of the ways I did that was to pick up a bunch of basics like this, because you could just throw this on with a pencil skirt, a midi skirt, jeans, shorts, whatever, <laughs> really. Like I have an outfit that I just thought of that I will be including in my spring trends video, which is coming up. I'm gonna be doing a video on like upcoming wearable spring trends. I do this every season almost. I also do a blog post on this every season for sure. So stay tuned for that. If that's something that, you know, is like, on your radar, definitely there are tons of people who cover trends, but I'm a curvy girl, so I, I look at trends from that lens and that perspective because not everything works on certain body types work on curvy girls, if that makes any sense. So yes, picked up this basic. They're about $14, I believe, maybe less. Um, Right now I'm super into matching my tops like in the same color. So now I'm thinking like I need to find a purple um, jacket to go with this one. 
I have a pink jacket to go with that one. <laughs> a ring head to toe, same color. It's not everybody's cup of tea, but I love it. So I'm, that's what I'm thinking right now. Continuing on with Amazon, I promised you guys that I was gonna share a few Valentine's Day pieces for you guys. And one of them is gonna be this V-neck sweater with the hearts. I'm not sure if I'm gonna keep this, to be quite honest. This is an Amazon Essentials. Amazon does have a whole section where they create their own clothes. They have a selection of what they call the drop where they partner with like influencers and celebrities and things like that to create like curated collections. They also have a whole section where they have their own like basics and things like that. So if you're looking for that, I swear by their daily ritual. Anyways, I plan to pair them with my red midi skirt that I just picked up from you won't believe where, you won't believe, okay? Look, I'm about to get into this brand, but just keep on watching, okay? This brand shook me. Like, all last year, I saw people talking about the brand. I'm like, oh my God, oh my God, this brand, this brand. I was like, first of all, you never shopped there, so you're a liar. But your girl took her own coins, not sponsored, and checked this stuff out, and I was quite definitely exceeded my expectations, okay? Thought about pairing it with jeans and some, some heels, some pumps, you know, and it's a very cute Valentine's Day type look if you're really into that. I'm not sure if I'm really into that, like being super literal, so I'm not sure if I'm gonna keep that, but comment down below, let me know if I should keep this sweater. Met yet. Hi, my name is Chi Chi and I'm the vlogger behind SuppleChic.com and SuppleChic TV here on YouTube where we cover fashion, beauty, and lifestyle. If that sounds like topics you're interested in, then you're in the right place. Subscribe now. And if you're already subscribed, girl, turn on those notifications so you don't miss a video. So my next two items are gonna be slip skirts. I picked up one in like this neon color that you cannot see. And then two, I picked up another one in red. Um, the neon one I picked up from Target. I picked it up from Target. Um, it's on clearance right now, so if you wanna grab it, I'm gonna link it for you down below. I wanted to do it with another neon top. I had this neon green skirt, silk skirt, that I thrifted a long time ago. Sadly, it got stains on it that I could not get rid of, so I threw it away. And I'm super happy to have this back in my life because apparently neons are in for spring. And I'm gonna be, do, be doing a spring trends video for you guys, so stay tuned for that. Um, but yeah, I grabbed this and super cannot wait to style it for the gram. The, you guys already know, I'm obsessed with slip skirts. I've styled them so many ways on this channel. I'm sure you're sick of it. Indulge me, please. So I also picked it up from In Red from you guessed. Walmart, okay, we went to Walmart. I saw this, they have these skirts in a variety of colors. I believe they're all on sale. Um, they have it in blue, black, red, and I think it was a fourth color, which I cannot think of right now. So if you're interested or you're interested in this skirt, then definitely jump on over, check it out. It's under $15, super affordable. Um, so yeah, don't miss, don't miss out on this. And on this one, I actually got this one and I got this in a 2X and a 3X. I haven't tried them on yet, um, simply because I had ordered this the first time in a 1X and it was too tight. I think the 2X is gonna fit, but I purposely prefer for my slip skirts to be oversized. That way they drape exactly how they're supposed to. They don't cling to any of the areas of my body that I don't want them to cling to, you know. They just create that silhouette. Um, when they're a little bit bigger. The only drawback is of course the waist, but you can't win them all. What I like about this Walmart one though is that it has like an elasticated um, waist, so it's like built in um, versus a lot of them that don't have elasticated waist. So if you have a little bit of a, you know, a tummy, then you will probably like this one because of the stretch that is involved. So onto accessories, I have two accessories to share with you guys in this video. And the first one are gonna be these pumps that I picked up from Nordstrom. They are the Jessica Simpson brand. They are like the Dior C or Dior C style with the cutouts right here. I really like, um, I'm a huge fan of animal prints if you guys don't know that because they're like basically a neutral and this pump fits, it's like perfect, 
works perfectly with um, a clutch that I'm about to show you guys in a few seconds. Hopefully the sliding, it doesn't blow it out. However, I just love like the different colors of brown in here, the taupe, um, the beige colors here perfectly with all the neutrals in my wardrobe. And you guys know that neutrals are very, very in for this fall and winter. Like wearing different shades of brown is a vibe and is a total thing. And this really helps kind of break up some of that, you know, solid block of color. I believe this is about maybe a three and a half to four, I believe this is like a four inch, maybe four and a half inch heel. I am a huge, huge fan of Jessica Simpson heels. I feel like they're great because they have a high end feel to them without being super expensive. These I, I scored on sale on Nordstrom and they have several versions in different colors, pinks, blues, this brown taupe color, and I will link them if they're still available for you guys down below. Now, I could not do this haul without sharing this bag. And now I'm just like, I don't know if I shared this bag in the last haul, I do not think so. But it is this gorgeous pouch bag. This pouch bag I am obsessed with. Okay, so this is definitely a dupe for a like $2,500 bag. These are a dupe for the Bottegas. Um, yeah. Sis is not paying $3,500. Even if I, even if there was that much coins, I wouldn't pay $3,500 for something like this because it is an on-trend style. It's also an ode to like a vintage style as well because I remember when I used to go thrifting in like the 2000s a lot, I used to see bags like this all of the time. So they brought it back and Sis is not finna pay $2,600 for it. So when I saw these dupes on Amazon, I freaking, like, I did not even, like, hesitate. I have been looking for, like, a creamy white colored clutch for years. Every single one I found, like, white is such a hard color. It can look cheap so easily. Every single one I found, just, it didn't work. It was kind of cheap looking, but I was super happy that this one was perfect because I think the original one that I linked sold out. But I found some other ones as well. And I actually just missed a woven version in black. Yes, that's how much I love these. They're like an instant update to like a date night look. I had this top on in my, what video was that? Either, I think it was the how to look better video. And I got a couple of, I got a couple of people asking me questions. I believe the top sold out. I don't, don't quote me on it. I will put a link to it in the description box down below. P.S. In the description box down below, you can find my height, my weight, my measurements, just in case you like, you're not sure if something will fit. I put all that information for you guys down there so that you can have a point of reference. Yes, I had this top on in that video and I'm, this top is in a size 3X. I tend to get a size 3X in anything I see on Forever 21 that does not look stretchy. And so, um, it's just like, it's supposed to be like an organza trench coat. Um, organza is like huge right now. And apparently it's still going for it into spring. And I feel like it's a piece that is somewhat timeless in that you can always wear organza when you're looking to go like a little bit more sultry and sexy. It's a, it's a fun way to add that kind of like, you know, va 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 voom to a look. Um, without trying that hard. I love the fact this is a trench. I would pair this with like a bralette if I really wanted to go like super sexy or like a tank top. It's just easy really. And some jeans and some heels. Cute top and jeans. That's like a trending thing right now. I should do a video on like a few um, ideas on something like that. But yeah, when you start getting older and you know you got kids or even if you don't have kids, you have work. Like it's just like, too much work trying to think of super intricate date night outfits. But a cute top and some jeans and some heels always, always pops. You could also do a turtleneck underneath that and put that on just to add a little bit of interest as well. So the next item is gonna be this gorgeous blazer that was sent to me by the wonderful ladies at Lezzy. I will put a link to them down below. The duo wanted to create something you could wear all day at work without feeling like stuffy and just, you know, constricted. He really wanted to create something that was, you know, environmentally friendly. Blazers are actually made out of coffee waste and recycled materials. And it's like a Jersey feeling, but it doesn't look like Jersey. It has this sheen to it that looks very expensive, that kind of looks a little bit luxe. 
has almost like a satin sheen that I think you could definitely take from day to night. I'm wearing the size 2XL for reference. If you're thinking of trying out the brand, I would say that a, a 2XL is about around the, a 16, 18. Definitely if you're under an 18, they are worth checking out. And I'll put a link to them down below. If I'm shouting them out is because they're like a newer brand to the scene. Love the way that they approached me. They were so nice about it. They didn't make any demands towards me. The way they went about relating with me really made it super easy for me to say yes. The next item, oh my goodness, I like, was so happy. Like my heart was so full. I even talked about it on Instagram. I was like, oh my God, guys, I'm so excited. This actually fits. I did a Zara haul. I bought like four or five items after watching Britney's video. And um, one of the items that I really, really wanted didn't, didn't just quite work out. It was a pair of shoes. I have wide feet, I know. I don't know why I wasted my time at all, but I did, um, cause I really like those shoes. Also, I've been wearing lip gloss a lot in all these videos and I get super self-conscious cause I'm like, oh my God, I hope everything is the way it's supposed to be. And you know, that gross white line isn't showing. Ah, pray for me, okay? Pray for me it's not showing in this video cause I can't stop. So the item is this leather shirt. Now, this isn't everybody's cup of tea, I know but leather separates are like took over the fall and winter um, runways. I'm obsessed with leather separates. This is super cute. It's like a shirt jacket. It has a belt so you can cinch in your waist and create a little bit of a waist or you can wear it, you know, open. You can wear it casually open. Like if I was traveling, I would totally just wear like a black turtleneck, some black joggers and throw this on top. As kind of like an overcoat, you know, cause the plane gets a little bit cold. And then on the other hand, I could also, when I get to my destination, put on like something like sheer underneath it or like a band tee, some heels and some jeans. Voila, I've got a look. Love me some multi-purpose clothing, okay? And this is it. Um, I got this in the largest size, which was a 2XL. Yes, Zara does make 2XL in certain things. I feel like they always go fast, so bear that in mind. I do not believe this shirt is still available, but if it is, there will be a link for you down below. So the next two pieces, I swear, like I was not expecting how much love these pieces got. Like I was shook, y'all, I was shook, okay? The amount of love that these pieces got was super surprising. Like I just, I was not expecting it y'all. But <clears throat> I told you guys earlier in the video that I went ahead and checked out a brand that I heard, I, I heard a lot of noise from influencers from last year, but I didn't believe it. Anyways, the brand is Walmart y'all. Walmart, Walmart's coming when it comes to fashion. Okay, they are deciding that they wanna take no prisoners. They wanna be relevant. They wanna be high fashion. They wanna be talked about. Okay, they want the millennials not to count them out. Okay. And honestly, I, I, I credit YouTube for this. I feel like those Walmart challenge videos really got Walmart thinking when it came to fashion. But anyways, I picked up this two piece set, okay, from Walmart. I can't, I can't tell you how many people placed orders for this set on LTK. Like it's so, I was just shook that so many people loved it. And mine, and I could totally get it. Like, you know, two piece sets are like, it's an outfit. You don't have to think about it. You don't have to, you know, figure out, oh, what top is gonna match with this bottom? What bottom is gonna match with this top? It's also super warm and cozy cause it's winter. The quality really isn't that bad. And a lot of the girls I saw, they didn't just buy one color cause it came in multiple colors. They bought multiple colors. Now this color sold out mad fast um, after I posted it but I believe that the black is still available. They have some mixed sort of colors. There's a gray, there's a black, there's two, a black and a gray combo. And there's like a gray and cream and white combo. And I'm honestly thinking of going to get the black combo because you can wear them so many ways. Like you could separate the set and you know, wear it with so many other things that it's just like such a great deal. And um, that if you scroll down the product page, okay, it'll tell you add the skirt or add the top and then 
you can get the top and the bottom for only $11. You heard that girl, $11 for a top on the bottom, which is probably why the girls bought two. <laughs> I don't think my deal was that good. I think I paid probably like $14 or $15 for bottom, top and bottom, but $14. Like for a top and a bottom that you could wear a thousand ways. The next item is gonna be this dress that is actually on my Instagram right now. I did a fun, super fun shoot with some of my favorite girls from DC who are bloggers. We did a Valentine's Day shoot. This dress, it's like a velvet dress. It has ruching everywhere on the sleeves, in the middle. The only thing it doesn't have ruching in the back and I really wish it did. But aside from that, it's gorgeous. It is from the Leith brand from Nordstrom. I picked this up in a size 2X. Um, I got in a 1X to compare and it's a short dress and I felt like the, the 1X was short and tight and sis is an old lady, okay? I'm an old lady, I'm okay with it. Team grandma, that's me. <laughs> Um, yeah, so I um, just did not want something that was short and tight, so I sized up, and I would recommend you size up, okay, because according to the site, I could have fit a 1X, but I got a 2X, and I think it goes up to a 3X, definitely, possibly a 4X, and a bunch of their plus size dresses are on sale right now, like 50% off. So I will link to this dress and some other options. If you're looking for some something sexy and date night-ish, definitely check it out. It actually came in black and if I did not need a pink dress, I would have kept the black. I feel like the black you will wear so many times. It's like a little, it's an LBD. It's cute enough that you could wear it to like a wedding. It's also cute enough that you can wear it to like date night. So yeah, I'm gonna link it. Hopefully it's still available for you guys below. So like when I tried on these jeans, oh my gosh, like my heart skipped a beat a little bit. Like, like it went pitter patter a little bit because I have been searching forever, like forever for jeans like this, like jeans that actually fit the way I imagined them in my head. Girl, girl, girl. The perfect straight leg vintage style fit and you guys must agree because i've worn these jeans like twice now on instagram i believe twice and every time i've worn it everybody's been like where are the jeans from the, give me the t give me the deets what's up tell me to give me the 411 so i felt like it would be so amiss of me to do this haul and not share these jeans with you and i believe they're on sale they come in black and they come in this color. They also come in a version that is not distressed. I wanna wear these all the time. Like I, my favorite jeans before these were my Target ones, which I still like, but this fits exactly how I want the Target ones to fit. Like just vintage Levi style jeans from the whiskering to the distressing. Just all of those details are present in these jeans also it comes with a button fly so you gotta button it up not a zipper like just straight up and down high waist enough just right at my belly button like at the bottom of my belly button is the perfect sort of space for my body they just fit because i even got like the true mom jeans from them and follow me on instagram you'd have seen i shared them both but the mom jean went way, way, was way too high waisted for me and it didn't do anything for my shape. So I returned it. I don't even think I tried that one on. I tried it on, it was like, ugh. I was like, you know what, I'm not even gonna bother. I shared these on Instagram. So that's the thing, like if you're following me on Instagram, then you get to see a lot of these things like right now. Um, watch my last vlog, you've probably seen me in those jeans. Those are the jeans that I wore to the Hanifa showroom party. If you didn't know, I post monthly-ish vlogs and every single vlog I always do a giveaway and it's still not too late to enter this month's giveaway. So I'm, I'm gonna put a link to that vlog because it's just my small way of giving back to this community that supports me so, so much. So if you really love the fashion finds that I shared in this video, then you will definitely wanna check out this video as well as this haul where I share some of my favorite winter fashion finds.